pocket tissue, man. I don't need pocket tissue. Maybe you will. Fine, I'll take a pocket tissue. the money. Yeah, <laughs> Isn't this the place we were just here? Yeah, you were. Ah. Thank you. I'm still holding the glasses. Yeah, you are. I just realized. Phone cards. I know you have some. Just give me a little peek at them. Uh. Fine. Eh. Look at the curves on this one. <sighs> yeah, nice Oi. and clear. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. I'm just looking at the cards. Why? Yeah. You said you saw something nice and clear. <laughs> oh yeah, I can look at a photo of a girl and see the whole shebang. Shebang? Haven't you ever stared at a girl's photo long enough that her clothes start to melt away? What? You know, you get a feeling for how she look, she look naked. You can imagine where all her curves are. 
Then you go to the club where she works and see if she really looks the way you imagine. Come on, you've done that, right? Yeah. No. Can't say I have. Eh. Seriously? Yeah, not even once. You a virgin or something? Daddy. Is that really something you just ask people? <laughs> Didn't think so. These days, everyone gets it out of the way in their teens. I don't know anyone over 20 who hasn't done it yet. Well, this is the 80s. If you find any more of those telephone cards with girls on them, let me see. All I need is a quick peek. I doubt it. You should say I'll even run into you again, anyway. I'm always at the various girly establishments getting my free time, but in between sessions, I might have time to meet. How do you have the stamina to keep that up? Well, I'm known for my boundless energy. My name's Akimoto. Nani? <laughs> Real men can go five times before they're even warmed up. No kidding. Alright, time to find a place to wreck the weasel. It's a friendship. ちょっと寄ってって。ね、ちょっとお兄さん。ちょっと遊んでから帰りたいですよね。やっぱ。いや、ちょっとビッグ。いや、ちょっとビッグ。いや、ちょっとビッグ。いや、ちょっとビッグ
Over here, Kiyu Kun. Who's this? Nani? It can't be. Did you get my message? I sent for you, Kiyu Kun. Master Daigo? <laughs> it's been a while. Daigo Kun, who's this guy? Kiyu Kun. He was a part of my father's family business. I heard he got kicked out for some reason, though. Oh, a former soldier then, eh? Say, why'd you get the boot? You popped a boner in the boss's office or something? What's the matter to you guys? You can leave now. I'm gonna hang with Kiyu Kun. But Daigo Kun, you said you'd spring for the party at the arcade. What happened to that plan? Another time. Not like there's anything special. Huh? You can't just ditch us after you call us out. What? You want to make something of it? <sighs> Never mind. I get it, Daigo Kun. Be seeing you. Master Daigo, did you need me for something? Come hang out with me. I just felt like hitting the town for a change. What now? Mom says that Dad's way too busy for me right now, so I've got a lot of time to kill these days. Yeah. Yes, but... What's the matter? You used to play with me all the time, right? You getting kicked out of the family doesn't mean we can't still hang out, does it? Well, if anyone from the family saw us together, things could be bad for you, Master Daigo. It's not a good idea. It's fine. Those spineless grunts don't have the balls to say anything to my face. All they do is talk behind my back. But... Chill out, Kyu Kun. You need to let go and have some fun. Come on! <laughs> kid's standing here like this. I've got enough money to cover us both. Besides, if you're with me, there's no way the family would risk messing with you. You're in real hot water, huh? Okay, we're off. First stop, the arcade. That'll do. Mm. The arcade. Okay. I just want to hang out with you, Kyu Kun. I don't really care where. Let's go already. Master Daigo, can we slow down a bit? Hey, can you quit with that master thing? You can just call me Daigo from now on. You're not a part of the Dojima family anymore, Kyu Kun. Yeah. Uh, no, I can't do that. Consider a request from a friend, not an order from a patriarch's son. Does that work for you? He always been a good kid. It's a miracle given his dad. I guess I can afford to give him a little time. Oh. Kiyu Kun, check that out. A UFO catcher? <laughs> Have you tried this before? I'm totally hooked on it. I've sunk so much money into these it's not even funny. Uh-huh. What should I try to get today? Check out my skills, Kyu Kun. Do I need to do anything? I'm giving you a demonstration first. Okay, here goes. Uh. Where is this bullshit? It sucks today. What's wrong with this place? The management must suck. Master Daigo, you shouldn't be dissing the business out loud. Uh. Don't tell me what to do. There's no end to this. Haven't you had enough? If I quit now, I've wasted all the money I've already used. And didn't I tell you to drop that master stuff? Yeah. Yes, but that wouldn't be... It doesn't matter. Anyway, Kyu Kun, your turn. Mm -hmm. I have 300 yen left. Let's see you get that for me. <laughs> I guess I can give it a try. I think I clipped it. I think I clipped it.
three for three. Probably not. Nope. Oh well. I got two Opa Opa figures for you, Daigo. Eh? No way! You got it? After all the money I dropped in, you just nail it? <laughs> it's just dumb luck, Master Daigo. You lined the you lined things up so it was easy to grab. Uh yeah. That must be it. Maybe it's time to call it a day then. I've got some things to take care of too. Mm -hmm. Huh? What are you talking about, Kyu Kun? We're just getting started. But let's go somewhere else. Not a kiddie place like this, but somewhere kids can't go by themselves. Somewhere kids can't go? Sega! Where do you propose we go? I told you. I want to go somewhere kids can't go by themselves. Not like, not that this neighborhood has anything but. Can't argue with that. Kiyukun, nah, nah. do you know a place called Asia? Mm. The continent we're on? Uh, no. It's a bikini bar. Yeah. Uh, no, a bikini bar would be inappropriate. Uh... Fine then. How about a telephone club? Or, I heard there's a place you can watch cat fights too. Maybe you could settle for a lounge? A lounge? Fine. I'll buy you a drink. Mm. I thought you ran out of cash. Yeah, a hundred yen coins. Plenty of bills where that came from. Oh. There's a lounge on Pink Street that should do. We'll see if they do version drinks, I guess. Uh... Hmm? <sighs> I'm sorry, but we can't have children here. Uh. I won't ask you to serve them alcohol. But can you just let us hang out here for a bit? Uh, I'm so sorry. I really can't help you. There are other guests I have to consider. <sighs> yeah, I know where you're coming from. Nah, nah. Hey, don't you know who I am? No, I'm sorry, but even if you were the Prime Minister's son, I'm still not allowed to let kids in. My father Sohei Dojima. He's the patriarch of the Dojima family. You want to reconsider that stance? <laughs> uh, you're joking, right? If this is a joke, why aren't you laughing? Yeah. Uh, well... You want to do business in this town? You better remember my name. It's Dago Dojima. Nah, nah. Over here, kyu -kun. Have a seat. I'm sorry, we won't stay long. Just make some oolong tea with soda or something. You can't be caught serving alcohol to a minor. <sighs> okay, I'll do that. Hey, how about some girls? Hurry up and send someone over. That's what you do at a lounge, right? We're a karaoke lounge. We don't really offer that kind of service. <sighs> what a sad little dive. I'm all... Oh, well then. I don't work here, but I'm a real-life hostess. How about I attend to you, hun? W wait a minute, lady. <laughs> I'll show you fu how... F I'll show you how fun grown-up talk is, young man. Ooh, you are so adorable. Hmm. Well, you'll have to do. Sit yourself down and be quiet, quick about it. Seriously? Oh my, are you really the son of the Dojima Yakuza boss? Many of the Dojima family gentlemen patronize our club. But I never knew Dojima-san had such an adorable son. What a cutie. Is that right? What grade are you in? Maybe you're around my little brother's age. Beats me. Mm -hmm. Oh, are you grumpy today? Or maybe you're just a little shy around a lady. What? Oh, you're adorable even when you're pouting. Listen, why don't you get lost? You're annoying me now. Excuse me? You say your little brother's in elementary school? Yeah, right. Don't you mean your son? And what are you trying to pull with this drink? It's just tea with a splash of soda. Do you think your guests are stupid? How much do you charge for this swill? Just because I'm a kid doesn't mean you can screw with me. <sighs> Some ugly bag jacks me up and I can serve fat, big kitty shit. What a joke. Master Daigo, I asked them to make you that drink. I know that. 
Although the hostess was unexpected. <laughs> <laughs> right? But the Daigo Dojima I know would never take pleasure in mocking a woman. What's wrong? No, it's nothing. It's just... Mm. Maybe things turned out this way because nothing ever happens in my life. I've got no one I can talk to. Anyone who wants to talk to me has an agenda, whether it's money or getting in good with my father. Mm. Master Daigo, mm. I told you not to call me that. You're not even in the family anymore. I'm sorry. Let's blow this joint, Kyuyu Kun. Keep the keep the change. Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh, uh thank you very much. Sorry about that. Yeah. No, it's fine. Where did Master Daigo go? Uh. What the hell? Mm -hmm. Uh huh? Shut up. Keep your yap shut. Hey, it's too hey, it's too crowded here. Let's get his ass over to the champion district. Good point. Walk, kid. Damn it! What was that about? Where's the champion district? This way. Oh. oh, wait. Okay, I'll fight you first. There you are. Oh, oh Kiyu-san. Got time for a stop and search? That's pocket tissues. This is about as safe as it gets. Doesn't look like you're carrying anything dangerous. Here, take this back. Your cooperation is appreciated. Company. Kiyu kun. What's wrong with you guys? Three on one against a kid? Damn it. We gotta take this asshole down too. They see our faces, we're dead. Uh -huh. I'm not dying here. You are. Okay then. You have a knife. Ouch. 
now we... Kiyu kun, take off their masks. Wait, these guys. Ugh. You were the kids hanging around Must Have Daigo. S sorry, please forgive me. Don't kill me, please. You guys jump me? Why? Uh. Hide your faces behind masks, will you? Kiyu kun, these bastards tried to kill me. Don't worry, these punks have no fight left in them. And if they did, they'd never raise a finger against the Prince of Dojima. Not that we know who they are. Are you saying I should let these scumbags go? It's your call, Master Daigo. I won't kill them, but I'll make sure they never walk again. Ah! These losers are just like the others I told you about. They only hang around me to mooch off me, like mosquitoes. They're scum that suck up on to an elementary school kid and then jump him when they get pissed. I'm sorry. Please, please forgive me. Look at them, Kiyu Kun. When they had their masks on, they were having the time of their lives punching and kicking me. Got all brave, didn't you? You should be glad I'm not going to kill you. Cut it out. Mm -hmm. Huh? I said cut it out, you little punk. Uh -huh. Kiyu Kun? I've kept my mouth shut so far, but enough is enough. What is this? You presume to lecture me? You want to be the spoiled rich kid who gets his way by throwing around his father's name? Fine. Be my guest. But torturing a defeated foe from a position of safety? That's not right. It's beneath a man. And me? I can't stand by and watch a man stray so far from what's right. Especially when that man is you, Dago. Uh, are you seriously laying a hand on the heir to the throne, Kyu kun You must know what they'll do to you. I don't care. I'd rather face the consequences than watch you go down a path you can't come back from. Kiyu kun Daigo, this will be one lesson you're gonna remember. Wah! Wah! I'm sorry! Didn't expect you to break down like that. Were you scared? Yes. But... I was happy, too. It's been a really long time since anyone saw me for who I really am and cared enough to put me in my place. I know I needed that. Daigo. Your father is a Yakuza patriarch. Not many are going to have the balls to treat you as an equal. But if you keep using money in your father's name as a way to get ahead, you'll never meet people who can measure up to you as peers. For people to bond as friends and equals, it takes time. You have to be willing to take that time, Daigo. Do that? Eventually, you'll make friends. And don't forget, you have at least one friend in me. Alright, on your feet, Daigo. I'll see you to somewhere safe so you can get home. No thanks. Hmm? I'm done depending on others. I can stand on my own and get there on my own two feet. No more parting on my parents' dime. No more getting my way on my name alone. <laughs> Becoming a man in a hurry, Master Daigo. Uh. That's enough. That's enough of that master stuff. Mm. Well, it'll be pretty tough to change how I address you all of a sudden. And I'll change how I address you. Mm. What? It was an honor and a privilege to spend the day with you, Kyu san Next time, may I buy you another drink, sir? Uh. Sure. I look forward to it. <laughs> okay. See you later then. Keeping that kid out of trouble is a full time job. But considering where I stand with the Dojima family, I may never see him again. Take care, Daigo. Grow up to be more than you are.